Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I just wanted to share with you guys some more Hobby Lobby clearance. Now most of what I got this time was Valentine's Day Hobby Lobby clearance. And all of the Valentine's Day stuff was 80% off y'all. And some of the stuff I can't hardly even believe that it was still there at the store. Because um, normally... You know, whenever my Hobby Lobby stuff goes on 80% clearance, like, there's not a lot um, that's left over as far as, like, really good stuff is concerned. So, I was quite surprised by the amount of loveliness that was still available. Um, so, I'm going to show you what I got. And then I got a couple things that were um, the 75% off and then a couple little things that were 40% off that I just had to have. So without further ado, first thing I got was these, um, you know, heart doilies. And for like, you know, 30 cents, you can't, I just can't leave it there at the store. Um, the next thing are these ribbons and I picked up three of each and they were originally $1.99. So whatever 80% off is of that is what I paid. I probably paid a um, dollar ninety nine for all of it, if that probably. So I picked up three of each of these um, ones. These were the only ones that were left, so I went ahead and got those. I picked up two packages of these um, foam sticker pieces. Um, there's eighty in a bag. I probably won't ever need another foam heart. Um, but I went ahead and got it because for, you know, 50, 60 cents, I mean, you can't beat that when it's original price of $3.99. And this one was $4.99. And these are just little, um, fillers, heart fillers, but we use these for so many different things. Um, so I got a bag of those. And then I got a bag of these felt open hearts, which I thought were so cute. And whenever they had their... Um, stuff before Valentine's Day. I almost considered paying the price for $2.99 to get a bag of these, um, but I didn't. Um, so I ended up getting two of them at 80% off. So at 80%, I'd much rather pay that price than, you know, three bucks for a bag of them. Um, I found two packages of these heart cutouts. Um, and they have um, different reds, some are glittered, some are not. There's 12 in each. There are big ones and small ones. Um, and so you're getting three of each of these here. Um, so I did pick up two packs, originally $2.99 on those. Let's see. Then I only found one of these, but I would have loved to have gotten a couple more of these because um, this is probably something that I will use um, quite a bit of. So we have red, white, and pink. So that is probably four of each of those. Um, and they're just foam shapes. Um, and originally they were $3.99. So yes, please. Oh, I'll take that. For what? What is that? Four dollars. That's like you know forty cents or something. Um, I found just a few. They had a ton of stickers left, but I didn't go crazy with the stickers. I did buy this um, Valentine's Day robots um, just because I thought they were so cute. And of course, I have boys, so if we have to decorate, you know, boxes or something next year, I have some robots. And then I found two of these critters. Um, and I re just really like the cow and the pig and the hedgehog on there. So I did pick up two of these. Um, I love this little pig and the hedgehog and the cow down there at the bottom. So stinking cute. So I did go ahead and pick up two of these. Again, thinking that if we had to decorate Valentine's Day boxes, this is kind of non-gender specific. They're animals. Um, so that, you know... The boys don't, aren't like, oh my god, it's like everything's girly. I did find two of these guys, and I um, just could not fathom. I really wanted these um, at Valentine's Day, 
uh, but for three dollars, I just wasn't going to buy them for three bucks for, you know, eight little cupcakes. I just wasn't going to do it, but I'm so glad they still had some left over because I would definitely pay, um, you know, 30 cents or whatever, 20 cents, whatever they were for these um, for certain. So there that is. Um, I did find this, guys. Now, I'm not even sure that I seen this um, while the Valentine's Day was going on, but this is originally $7, and there is 850 pieces in here, and like these hearts and things, like a lot of this is Valentine's Day, but also there's like, you know, little arrows and um flamingos and love things like I think that you could use like the majority of this stuff like not on Valentine's Day like of course you know the stuff that says happy Valentine's Day on it you're not going to want to use um, but some of this um, a lot of this you can use that is not Valentine's Day maybe Mother's Day um, like you know sweet forever you know, with love, like that stuff doesn't have to be necessarily for Valentine's Day, I don't think. Um, and this was the only one that was left. They also have alphas in here. Here's just a little bit on the back. They have like these alpha pages and these pages here that are just straight up heart stickers, you know. Um, so I thought this was a really sweet bargain. I would never have paid seven bucks for it, but I would pay it at the 80% off, no doubt. Now, I only found one of these. These are um, a gift tag set, but can I can't see where this at all is Valentine's Day related. There is one tag that says um, like XOXO on it, but I can't um, even with that, like all you would have to do, if you guys, I'm not going to take it apart, but it's just one little strip that goes across that tag. And all you would have to do really is cover that up with washi tape or something or add another um, layer on that. But these tags are just super cute and 80% off $3.99. I will take it. Um, they've kind of fallen down out of the package, but that's okay. I'm not too worried about that. So that is all the stuff that I got for Valentine's Day on the Valentine's Day 80% off. And I'm going to now show you a couple things that were marked down, that weren't marked down prior. Um, and that is these little candy pieces, the knickknacks. Um, I don't know exactly how many pieces is in there because it's covered up. But it was only 75 cents. There's probably 12 pieces in there. Um, so I will save that. This is... You guys, like, I can't, these are too stinking cute, these glasses. Again, 75 cents. Um, I would have bought every single pack of these glasses had I seen them, but this was the only one. Um, super cute. Um, I don't know why they're, like, they keep going back. They're, like, destroying me. They keep going back and marking on, marking down different things as the weeks go by. Um, I would much prefer for them to do it all at one time so that I can stop going in there, but they're not. They're torturing me. Um, so here are some brads that are like the ghost eyeballs. They were a dollar. There's ten of them in there. Super cute. And I picked up another pack of these because they were sitting all by themselves and they're just the flamingos. They're, they're acrylic. There's six of them in there. For a buck, I found this set of envelopes for $1.25. These are six pieces. I can't hardly get over how these, a set of six um, envelopes was $5. Like, I would have never paid $5 for that. Anywho, so I got that. And then I got, found some of these vellum envelopes, which are super, super pretty. Um, and there is 12 of them in here. And these are in the A2 size. I'm not sure all of them are gold. Are they? And maybe I just can't tell. I guess so. Some of these edges on these ones are not edged. In gold. 
or it's probably just the way I guess the envelopes cut. Anyway, super cute vellum envelopes. Um, I did find a couple more stamps that they had marked down that weren't marked down, and these are Halloween ones. Um, and this one just says trick or treat on it, something sweet down there at the bottom. Um, originally it was four bucks, marked down to one. Um, this one is a six forty nine, and it just says happy Halloween on it. And it was a dollar sixty two. And this one is just like a witch and it says smell my feet. Originally this one was $8.99 marked down to $2.25. Super, super cute. I love this stamp. And then they had some more ink pads marked down, y'all. And I don't have a ton of... I'm so excited for this sale because I didn't have a ton of ink and I don't have a ton of stamps per se. I mean, I have quite a bit now because I've been buying them as they're marking them down. Um, but I'm excited to build some of my ink pad sets and things like that uh, and stamps and stuff so I can start doing some like heat embossing hopefully and things. I'm like, I've seen people hauling. Um, like the you know distress glitter and stuff like that that you use for embossing but my store hasn't marked them down yet oh excuse me y'all okay so this is hero arts and this is ombre ink pad and that bad boy was ten dollars like this is probably the reason why i've not bought a ton of stamps and ink pads is because $10 for one ink pad, I can't even, like, I wouldn't buy it for that. Um, I would buy something less expensive for sure. So this is a Hero Arts, and I paid $2.50 for it, and it's kind of like the orangey, um, yellowish, reddish one. Super cute. And this one also was $10 bucks marked down to $2.50, and it's kind of like the purple, pink, and you know maybe a little bit of red in there super cute this says uh, neon red to purple and this one says butter bar to orange soda so and then I found one more in like the greens and blues and this one says um, neon kerchiefs to blue super super duper awesome and then I did find this Hero Arts in Neon. This one was originally $8 marked down to $2. And it's just straight up neon pink. Um, so y'all know I had to pick this one up. And these were the only four that were marked down um, this time around. So these are the four that I got. But don't think I won't be going back again next week to see. It's because they, I don't know if they do that intentionally or what they do. I don't know. I don't know why they do that. Why they can't just mark everything down. And then I got this donut paper punch. As you guys can see, that thing is originally $15.99, marked down to $4.25. And this is the punch I do believe I can make shakers with. Um, so I will probably give that a go um, this coming up little bit. Um, I don't know exactly when I'll get back into the craft room. I am moving my stuff out to the garage because my craft stuff is just taking over my room here. This is my bedroom that I'm in and I just don't have enough space to work. So my husband graciously cleaned out a section of the garage for me to use and has made me a big old desk in there and um, I will show you guys that as we finish it up. Um, but we're working on moving me out, out of here and into the garage and I'm really excited about it. So um, I'll see what I can do with this punch. And as you guys have said, if you watch my channel, I keep saying that I'm trying to build up my tool supplies. So as I see stuff go on clearance, like the stamp, the ink pads, the, the, um, not stamp, this is not a stamp, this is a punch. The stamps, as the stuff goes marked down, I'm going to try to pick it up to build up my tool supply. And these little um, things here were just marked down 40%, um, but 
Look how stinking sweet this is. So stinking cute. These will go as decor in my house. And here's a little galvanized tub. Um, this little tub was like $2.99, marked down 40%. And then this one was $3.99, marked down 40%. So stinking cute. Um, I just love galvanized metal for my farmhouse theme things. So super, super cute. I will be setting those out after Easter when I go back to my farmhouse themed things. Right now it's covered with Easter things. Um, and that is it, guys. That is all of my Hobby Lobby clearance, Valentine's Day, and 80 or 80% off Valentine's Day and 75% off the rest of the store. Um, minus the two uh, galvanized tins. Those were 40% off. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like the video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I hope everybody has a great weekend. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!